Turkey vultures, for as big of a wing as they have, are notoriously bad flyers. This is what you're told you don't want to see if you're dying, laying on your back out in the middle of the woods, a bunch of vultures flying over. The thing about this particular thing, though, is that just because they're doing this does not mean that they found food. Turkey vultures rely on thermals to keep up in the air. They can go six hours without a single flap of the wing. And when they find a good thermal, well, a, the air comes from below and pushes up, warm air against cold air. It's, it's complicated, but that's the basics, and they l rely on it, and that's why when they fly, they kind of just go side to side. They're just kind of trying to catch that draft. And sometimes, the smell of their prey, which is, you know, carrion, gets caught up in that draft, and they will fly over towards that area. But nine out of ten times, if they're flying over an area, it's not because there's food. And that one out of ten times where there is food, they're probably flying over it because there's something else that's eating it. Uh, you know, another predator in the area, and they're waiting for the danger to disappear. But as soon as that danger is gone and the food is that they want is there, they will go down and get it. Otherwise, they're there just because it's easy to fly there.